All right, the uh, waiting game continues in lower Manhattan right now as a grand jury and New York's district attorney are expected to make the next move in the case involving former President Donald Trump. He is accused of having an affair with an adult film star and using campaign funds to keep the whole thing quiet. NBC's Jay Gray joining us now live with what's next in this case. Jay? Yeah. Hey there, Danny, Keith, and look, the situation, the circumstances here are unique. A U.S. president or ex-president has never in history been indicted for a crime, and that's exactly what hangs in the balance here. To come up here and see what's going on. Oh, I see. The possibility of history on hold right now as the circus grows outside the district attorney's office in New York. The ringmasters, former president and current Republican candidate Donald Trump, and New York DA Alvin Bragg, a Democrat, locked in a legal tug of war over allegations campaign funds were used to reimburse former Trump attorney and fixer Michael Cohen, who says he paid adult film star Stormy Daniels $130,000 to keep quiet about an affair she had with Trump in 2006. They got to find somebody to lie. To this point, the arrest that former President Trump predicted on social media has not materialized. The protest he's called for. You know, Trump innocent on that, you heard? Bringing less than a dozen supporters to lower Manhattan with proceedings at a standstill. The grand jury apparently sits Mondays and Wednesdays. So if there was not an indictment yesterday, um, which by all accounts is the case, you know, one really has to think it's going to be tomorrow. Security remains on high alert. Barricades, extra officers and surveillance cameras in place ahead of any action in or reaction to a high profile case. Yeah, and one other thing to consider here, there are at least four other investigations into allegations against the former president ongoing across the country right now. Keith, Danny? Jay, thank you for that. Well